Nurul Islam University in rural Tamil Nadu's Kumarakovil has shot into fame, becoming the latest to boast of a university satellite, NIU Sat, which will enter into orbit along with ISRO's Katosat. The aim to monitor agricultural crops and better disaster management. I have entered into this project not for the fame, but I have seen that during the tsunami, tsunami season, I was there. And I have seen so many calamities there. We have done so many process and afterwards this is going to take seven years. We have spent nearly more than 50, more than 50 CR. Five years. Yeah. No, no, 15 CR. One five. The journey began in 2012 and has involved over 100 students and faculties from the university. NIU SAT has been conceptualized and designed by Nurul Islam University with continuous inputs from ISRO, though finally produced by an industrial partner. Whether the idea is true or false or whether it, where are we going in the right direction or not, we don't know because we don't have that much of exposure. So for that only we rely on ISRO. Students are now being trained in batches to handle the mission. All of us who are studying here are not get opportunity like this. So individual, it's a great pressure for me to be a part of it. Once the satellite is launched, the PSLV will just put the satellite in the particular intended orbit. From that, all the control will come to the ground station at NIU, Nurul Islam University, here at Kumarakoil. So we have a dedicated ground station, just like ISRO, we have already set up to receive the satellite. There's massive excitement among students. They have had sleepless nights for months now, but this is not where they are going to stop. They say their next aim is to have a constellation of satellites to monitor the agriculture areas around this entire university. With Pallav Bagla in New Delhi and camera person SP Babu, Sneha Koshi from Kumara Kovil's Nurul Islam University.